At Intec, we understand the complexity of deploying electrical and power systems on a greenfield project. That is why we help you reduce complexities and fast-track your project's execution by offering electrical power and substation systems in a single building or SCID. We have recently manufactured two e-houses and two EMCC buildings for deployment on two newly built trains at a gas processing plant in one of the largest supergiant fields in the world. The e-buildings are fully welded and painted type constructions covering an area of over 600 square meters and come equipped with their own air conditioning, lighting and small power systems and fire alarm control panels. The two main sections of these e-buildings comprise of low and medium voltage switchgear panels with cabling and wiring for all panels neatly managed under the building. Each panel consists of a single unit equipped with a circuit breaker, contactor or switch disconnector and includes all accessories necessary for conventional switchgear units. The low voltage section comprised of Siemens LVMCC panels with Siemens Synamics variable frequency drives. The medium voltage switchgear had 11 kV ABB Unigear switchgears. A remote operation panel enables safe monitoring of LV and 11 kV incoming breakers from a distance. We also provided two emergency power switchgear e-houses equipped with high availability AC and DC UPS systems, emergency MCCs and a separate battery room fitted with zone rated equipment for temperature maintenance. The overall electrical system combines conservative design topology with proven digital control technology to offer the best performance in any electrical and environmental condition. Intech services on the project are helping our client achieve the objective of increasing current production capacity by 40% by capturing flared gases. This will not only reduce wastage but also convert flared gas into dry gas for power generation and into liquids for domestic and export markets. Are you looking for similar expertise for your project? Let's talk about it.